So the Signature Scholars Research Program is a student-centered, inquiry-based program. It's designed for upperclassmen at O'Neill. It's a two-year program. It's designed to offer a protracted, a lengthy course of study for upperclassmen. So during their junior year, students take research methodology and philosophy. And during that year, they do a lot of exploratory research. And at the end of the year, they have um, written an annotated bibliography of upwards. Uh, it's got to include at least 35 sources, say. And they write a research proposal. And then their second year of the program is when they participate in a focalized study and writing portion or, or a similar project right, of comparable weight. Um, the paper's got to be at least 10,000 words. So that second year is when they do most of their writing. Uh, and they're applying the research that they've done from the first year. But throughout both years, what me and Mr. Williamson, for instance, found in this year with this cohort is that the presentation component offers invaluable experience for the students in the program for a number of reasons. One of which is getting comfortable with different audiences and understanding that not every audience shares the same level of interest in your topic that you do. The challenge of meeting different audiences um, is part of becoming a, an academic, a scholar, just a professional person. Learning how to talk to different groups of people about your topic in a way that makes the topic relevant and interesting to them. So the presentation component helps students with that. It also offers them the chance to continually redefine and re-articulate and refine and rediscover what about their topic interests them. Because really, you don't learn something until you teach it. As a senior in the Signature Scholars Research Program, me and two other seniors uh, at the O'Neill School are conducting research. A couple of us have continued our research from our previous class in AP English Language and Composition. Um, for me, my topic last year was uh, access to education for disabled Americans. And this year, I've continued it with a different focus um, for pharmaceutical regulation and drug access for American adults with disabilities. Um, so through the researching process, as your senior year, you're writing this 10,000 word paper and you're kind of honing in your focus, making contacts in the local community. And we conclude with this symposium um, where we invite those people from the local community to present, their inf to present the information that we found all year and kind of end it with a bang. Okay, so I've been researching the Tudors, who's the English ruling family from the 15th to 16th century since I was in eighth grade. And while researching, I noticed a trend that women are actually the one that advance the Tudors in their political and social power each generation. So I've been studying five women and um, just no um, noting their um, transition from whether it be uh, servants to nobility to monarchs and how those women have eternalized the family. And overall my arching theme is to emphasize the role that women have always had in politics and issues beyond the domestic sphere. The Signature Scholars Research Program is a two-year program open to juniors at O'Neill. I'm currently doing preliminary research collecting sources and contacting experts in the field in regards to my topic that in my senior year I will write a 10,000 word research paper about. My topic specifically is on the future of um, space travel, its feasibility, and engineering concerns regarded to that. So I am, for instance, contacting people who have written papers on different technologies in that area. Myself and Emma, the two juniors in the program, will end this year with a document containing all of our source notes and with con various contacts in the um, greater community. And we will enter next year beginning to write the paper, drawing on those resources and connections that we've made and the techniques that we have learned this year in regards to research. I am starting my research regarding how the different classes of women in Victorian England contributed to the idea of the new woman at the turn of the century. So for example, I'm examining how the world of prostitution in Victorian England contributed to the idea of like the sexual liberation movements and other similar things um, 